on record. Let's turn to the Weather Authority forecast uh, right now. Violet is in on a Monday late afternoon. It's gorgeous. Oh, yeah. It's beautiful. gorgeous. Beautiful outside. Tomorrow looks even better, too. Great. But it's going to be the last couple of days that'll be totally sunny for a while. And we're also looking ahead to some summer like weather where we have to deal with the threat of storms and some warm temperatures as well, which is going to fire them up. So for this afternoon and this evening, Right now, temperatures are in the upper 60s to lower 70s. We'll be keeping the sunshine as we head into sunset and clear skies tonight. We're watching a weather system to our south. This one looks to take a path to the east, so dodging us, but bringing us some warmer temperatures for tomorrow. However, we are watching a stronger system right now. It's bringing tornadoes and th severe thunderstorm warnings over areas by Oklahoma, Arkansas, even up into North and South Dakota. This system is going to get stretched apart and then as it breaks up, eventually makes its way over to central New York. So it's not going to be as strong as it gets to us, but it is producing some very intense severe weather across the middle parts of the country over the next couple of days. This is the severe weather threat for today. Notice that Oklahoma is in the highlight. Tomorrow it moves a little bit further east over the Ohio Valley. Then Wednesday is when it looks to reach closer to us. There will still be the threat for some strong to severe storms across the Ohio Valley, but even into the northeast, we could see some stronger storms. Right now the risk they only have across the southeastern portions of New York State, but I think that we still could see a storm on the stronger side, even in the center New York area, and this will be mainly during the day on Wednesday. So timing this out exactly with our future cast right now, we have sunshine outside temperatures in the lower 70s, keeping the sunshine as we head up until sunset with just some thin high clouds. Then any of those lingering clouds clear away to completely clear skies overnight and becoming a little chilly starting off tomorrow morning in the upper 40s, but warming up very quickly by lunchtime, upper 60s, then we'll be in the mid 70s by the afternoon. And there may be some thin high clouds, but we're looking at almost complete sunshine through the day tomorrow. Tomorrow night is when that system gets closer. We'll have increasing clouds through the overnight and then we'll start to see some thunderstorm activity after midnight, but especially getting closer to the sunrise hour. 4, 5, 6 a.m. is when we'll see scattered thunderstorms, some of which could produce some gusty winds, heavy rainfall, of course, some lightning as well. And that'll be our first round that runs through around sunrise. Then we'll get some dry periods, but we could see some more thunderstorms popping up Wednesday afternoon and evening and some of these could also be on the stronger side just because of that daytime heating that we get before that second batch as we go overnight into Thursday clouds are going to be sticking around but we look to be generally dry up until late Thursday morning that's when our next weather system rolls through looking to bring widespread rain through the day Thursday Thursday night sticking around for Friday maybe even some lingering sprinkles as we head into Saturday as well Looking at your seven day forecast, sunshine tomorrow, mid 70s. Wednesday, we have to deal with scattered storms. The threat for some to be stronger. First round in the morning, second round in the late afternoon. We'll be in the mid 70s in between. Cloudy for Thursday and Friday with widespread rain, but we generally look to dry out on Saturday with decreasing clouds, dropping though into the 50s and 60s to start the weekend. Mother's Day will be our next chance to see some scattered thunderstorms, and that threat continues into the start of next week as well. Michael. Thanks, Violet. Coming up.